fellow felines, this is Kitty Cat Players of the Yarn here, and welcome to another renovation. So today, I am renovating a Slipshod Mesquite, and that is also known as the trailer where Johnny Zest lives. So basically, I was in the mood to renovate a lot, and I asked my friends on Twitter, you know who you are, shout out, um... <laughs> I like, I'm like, yeah, shout out. I'm not going to say who you are, though. But I asked, and I was like, what lot should I renovate? And one person goes, land grab mansion. And I'm like, okay, let's be realistic. What should I renovate? <laughs> so then I ended up renovating this. And I actually really like how it turned out. I kept it very similar to the original. I pretty much kept the layout. I kept the kind of, like dingy bachelor kind of gross nature of it I guess I mean like it wasn't gross to start out with but it was like very dark and like didn't have a lot of furniture in it and I tried to keep it that way so you guys will see that like I just don't put a lot of furniture in it because I felt like it was fitting to have less and I also used the cracked version of the tiles that were already in here from City Living and I used quite a bit of that City Living stuff because uh, City Living if you don't know came with like a bunch of things that we had in base game but like more like run down versions of it so that's what I used so that's where the flooring's from that's where the wallpaper is or the flooring in the kitchen and bathroom is from. That's where the counters are from. Uh, that's where the fridge is from. And I think the stove is as well. Is like the same kind of, oh yeah, it's gross and used. Uh, I also used that used bed. And I want to say that's it, but I probably ended up using something else gross from City Living as well. And yeah, that's just kind of the vibe I was going for in this. Um, and I know some people will be like, oh, that's kind of lazy, but I feel like it makes sense and it goes along with, like, how Johnny Zest is. So that's my reasoning for that. And like I said, it's also not very cluttered because um, he's a bachelor. I imagine he's probably not doing too well for himself because he did kind of get kicked out of, like, the land grab family, right? I think that's the story. I can't quite remember, but I'm pretty sure that's the story. Like, he's technically a land grab, but no one will, like, own up to it. Right? I think? I think that's how it goes. Let me know if that's how it goes in the comments, because I can't quite remember. Also, if you hear lots of background noise, I apologize. Uh, the dryer's going, the AC is going, and the washer is going, because... I'm kind of sort of prepping for a vacation, actually. Um, I'm going to be gone for like four or five days, uh, just like not very far away, like a few hours away from my home. But it's a vacation nonetheless, and I'm very excited about it uh, and look forward to a vlog from that vacation uh, for reasons. I don't want to spoil it, but I'm really excited. Just thinking about it has me like all giddy and stuff. I'm, I'm really hyped. Uh, but yeah, so happy Saturday. Um, I hope you enjoyed the part of Birthstone Legacy la yesterday. I was going to say last week. I don't know. I hope you enjoyed the part of Birthstone Legacy from yesterday. Uh, I definitely enjoyed it, even though it was kind of chill, but chill episodes aren't always a bad thing. And actually on Monday, I am going to be posting a makeover video of Johnny Zest to kind of go along with this renovation of his home. And I don't think I mentioned this, but on the exterior I used, um, well, windows and doors, exterior. Uh, for the windows and doors, I used Strangerville because I just kind of really love Strangerville. And um, yeah, I don't know, I really love Strangerville. Oh, I also used that rundown couch that you can get at the flea market. Um, I had one heck of a time trying to figure out the cheat so I could get that because it was such a pain in the butt. I couldn't remember it for the life of me, but I found it in the end. So yay me. 
and I don't know. I just had a lot of fun with with this re- renovation because, like, like I said, I kept it like the same kind of dingy, dirty, like he doesn't really have a lot of stuff kind of look. Um, I did put a globe bar in there though because I felt like. I don't know, I just felt like that was his vibe, and I also ended up putting a dartboard in, I believe, because, like I said, Johnny Zest is like a bachelor, so I feel like he kind of has some, like, a little, a few fun things, and by a few fun things, I mean, like, a bar and a dartboard, and that's pretty much it. Like, he doesn't have much, but that's okay. And he also has a double bed, so there's that. But yeah, I don't know, I just had a really fun time with this. And this actually didn't take me long, as you can tell by the length of the video. Um, It took me like half an hour, I think. So that's why this video is so short. And then the makeover on him took like 10 minutes. And I know, I know, I know, it's because like you don't take as much time with male sims as you do female sims, but... I, I don't know, I can't object to that. Like, you're right. Because <laughs> I definitely pay more attention to female sims than I do male sims, but it works. And I also ended up putting that little, like, cubby thing in as a dresser because I feel like he doesn't have many clothes either. And, like, that was, like, something really cheap that he, like, found on a yard sale or something. So he just kind of picked that up and was like, yeah, I can use this for my clothes. Because, like, he probably doesn't have a lot. Like, I don't know many guys that have a lot of clothes anyway. So, like, I feel like he can definitely just fit all of his belongings in there. And then that's the end of it. But, yeah. So, we're just working on the bathroom now. And we're going to be jumping into screenshots pretty soon. Um, so, yeah. We're just working on putting, like, a few finishing details in. There's not much. And I changed this, like, very minimally, the exterior. Um, I added, like, a few more plants. And I changed the color of the the chairs, and I'm pretty sure that's it. But I am going to get going right now, so I hope you guys are having a perfect afternoon, evening, or whatever, wherever you are in your neck of the world. And be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to become a paw print, because I post new videos all the time. And I will see you all in the next video.